Drillers had not realized that wells could be seriously crooked until the development of Oklahoma's Seminole field in the 1920s. Suspicions arose when some wells required considerably more casing to complete than others. Finally, when two offset wells being drilled simultaneously actually collided subsurface, it was painfully realized that severely crooked holes were possible. Soon after this, deviation controls and contractual specifications regarding allowable deviations were discussed and written down. At first, these controls were loose, with deviations of 10 to 15 degrees being accepted practice. However, California court cases soon ruled that wells crossing over lease boundary lines onto other properties constituted trespassing, with lawsuits resulting. In 